good morning students today we are going to start with our next lesson why do we fall ill okay children you are all aware of the disease which is spread which has spread these days the corona the pandemic disease everybody every other person they are all finding out ways to protect themselves from this disease it is in fact a deadly disease so many people are dying throughout the world okay so this chapter is a really amazing lesson we'll come to know a number of things when this lesson about different types of diseases you people have heard somebody some people are saying that they are having diabetes some are saying that they are suffering from thyroid some are saying they are having tuberculosis pneumonia dengue so many diseases are there many of them are saying that they are suffering they had a severe heart attack so we all are listening to so many diseases every day now have you ever thought why it is happening what is the reason for these diseases okay in your previous class chapters you have read about the cells the tissues so we'll begin with all these things right okay children now we are going to learn about the different things which we are going to learn are number 1 cells and its relation to the body function now you know they all are interrelated you know the cells they join together to form tissues tissues they join together to form organs organs they again join together to form organ system and finally the different organ organ systems they form an organism okay now the second thing which is which we are going to study in this lesson is that all the organs they are interconnected for example our brain it is connected to our heart right similarly your muscles it is connected to the brain the legs hands everything they are connected to the brain okay even now like i'm speaking i'm blinking okay again it is connected to the where is it connected it is connected to our brain right now the next thing which we'll be doing in this lesson is we'll be learning about the difference between health and disease you people know what is health it is a state of being completely fit when you, when you don't have any disease that means a person is said to be healthy okay and diseases the different i just now i told you about the different diseases right and we know who is a healthy person who is an who is which person is infected with the disease right now and even diseases they are of different types the infectious diseases for example a person is having cold what happens or a person coughs what happens so a person who is standing close to him it is there is a severe chance that a, that person is going to catch cough or cold like these days what are we saying we are asking everybody to put a mask why is it so that the symptoms the symptoms are cough okay so immediately the person standing next to us that person is not infected that is why we are taking all precautions right so it is a infected disease okay so now there are diseases it is not necessary that all diseases are infectious there are many diseases which do not spread for example diabetes thyroid does it spread from a person to person no it does not spread thyroid it is caused due to deficiency of iodine right you people have all studied about it in your previous classes similarly diabetes why is a person suffering from diabetes when his sugar level increases okay insulin is not produced right similarly you must have heard about many genetic diseases also which are being transferred from the parents to the offspring so there are different types of diseases okay and the next thing what we are going to study 
is about how diseases spread. Okay, that also you know. They, there are many things with the carriers are there. Some are uh, virus, they are spread through virus. Okay, then other uh, like, uh, what do we say? Now children, you are all grown up. And you know, all know, you all are aware about how diseases occur and what are the different ways or what are the different things we should do to protect ourselves from these disease. Okay, you know very well that who is our enemy, what do we do? We always try to protect ourselves from that, right? So, children, now you know, you people are or we can say that our future generation, they are becoming great warriors. They are well aware about, about everything. Okay. So these days, like the disease, again, I'm coming to that same disease because we all are, we all are hearing about it day by day. Okay. So it is spreading so fast. Okay. And so if we don't study this chapter, we won't be able we won't be able to know how, what are the different ways how it is spreading how we can protect it is it clear so children i today i have just told you a brief recap about all things which we are going to cover in this lesson in my next video i am going to tell about the difference what is health what is disease and what are the difference between health and disease? Is it okay? Thank you, class.